These wiggly worms are called Aeolosoma and can be found in different freshwater habitats in many parts of the world, like ponds and streams. But it's not just in nature you're able to find these, as they also inhabit almost all freshwater aquariums and probably also a huge part of unchlorinated pools. Even though they might look a bit scary and poisonous with their orange spots and long spikes, they are completely harmless to humans. They feed on decaying plant material, microalgae and other microorganisms. And the way they do this is a bit strange. These worms are known as suction feeders, which means that they use their mouth as a vacuum cleaner to get their food. When they find something that they want to ingest, they surround it with their mouth and tiny beading projections inside the mouth then creates a vacuum that sucks up the food. And if the vacuum cleaner mouth isn't weird enough for you, this might be. When Aelosoma worms reproduce, they almost always do it asexually by growing a clone of themselves. The clone starts to take form from the tail end of the parent worm, and then slowly turns into a separate organism. Towards the end, it looks a bit like the daughter worm is biting the parent in the tail. Sometimes several clones can be developing at once, leaving a chain of the parent worm and its clones. A single mature worm is only about 2 mm long but the chain of unseparated clones can be up to 10 mm long and looks a bit like a tiny and thin piece of hair without a microscope. The orange spots covering the worm are a collection of lipids, forming these colorful drops of oil. Here they are orange, but in other species they can be both green, blue, red and colorless. Not much research has been done on these colorful oils and their function is not clear. Maybe they serve as an energy storage. Maybe they are helpful in scaring off predators. Or maybe a combination of the two or something entirely different.